and his opponent, weighing in a total of 220 pounds, he comes to us tonight from the Super Dave Osborne Stunt Academy, this is Danger Jameson! Danger Jameson is a sight for sore eyes. I have to take a second and be a little bit impartial. It's been a while since I've been back next to professional wrestling. To see the man from the Super Dave Osborne Stunt Academy, our glorified stuntman extraordinaire, is back. And I couldn't be happier as he takes on the tattooed one from Norway, Dylan Black. Mabo, what are your thoughts early on? Well, I can tell you right now, I was, it was a treat for me back in the month of August when Fandemonium was on and I was able to witness Danger Jameson in person and I can tell you right now you have to be here at excellent, excellent professional wrestling to fully enjoy what Danger Jameson brings to the table. Some would call him an acquired taste. Some would call him an experience. But our glorified stuntman is here looking to Get a notch in the wind column against Dylan Black. Like Dylan, no, Dylan Black. Dylan Black is someone, you know, they say, you know, you would not want to meet this person in a, in a dark alley. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to meet Dylan Black in a field in the middle of the day. That's, that's very true. Very enigmatic. I'm sure that each detailed piece of art that adorns his body, including that giant, looks like demon face on his entire front of his torso paint a very intricate story that I'm sure that over the next months and possibly years here at Excellence Professional Wrestling that the fans will get to be more in tune with. Well, I can tell you right now, it takes a different breed of person to tattoo their entire skull. That's very much so. I, I am a wimp to pain. I don't like it. Inside out or outside in. Danger bringing the fight back into the ring, whether Dylan wants to or not. Danger uh, Jameson ascending to the top turnbuckle. Looking for a big splash. He, does, he is known to go there from time to time. But look at Dylan Black using the referee as a human shield. You see, that's the thing. It's Dylan Black Oh, that, with that deadly kick right there. Dylan Black doesn't have to cheat to win. Dylan Black is an amazing professional wrestler. Big deal off the top. Danger Jameson in trouble very early on in this matchup. Danger Jameson, big boy to come to toss off that top rope. Yeah, he's definitely big man quality for sure. But he's a glorified stuntman, you know. Even if you're not necessarily supposed to fall in awkward positions, He's a guy, he's like, he's a, he's a bouncy ball that you hit out of the concession for the, uh, the quarter machine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, it hits the ground and it bounces back up. The most resilient superstar on the excellent professional wrestling roster. And he looks to show it right now as Dylan Black stalks the man from the uh, Super Game Osborne Stunt Academy. Ooh, right between the shoulder blades and a shining wizard. Directly to the face and the skull of Dan Jensen. Near fall only to the official John Rankin. And, and the best thing is, you know, with Jameson's training, he's learned to take those falls. Now, normally he's wearing a helmet, and I'm pretty sure after that shiny wizard, he's going to wish he had that. Right, I don't know if it's necessarily ring regulation that he can have. That, uh, that helmet on inside the squared circle. But definitely we need to go to the game, redraw a game plan as he hits him with a knee to the midsection. But stopped right in his tracks, snuffed out with that big leaping leg lariat. Both of them going tip for tap with each other in the various strikes. It seems as though whenever Danger Jameson can find a kink in the armor of Mr. Dylan Black, that Dylan, right there, able to change his, his game plan, find a new method of attack, and get back on the onslaught against Danger Jameson. Well, Danger Jameson definitely in a, a prone position right now. If, if I personally know Dylan Black, I would strike now, strike without mercy, get the pin, go. But he's, he's toying with Danger Jameson, and you cannot underestimate him. And as the fans rally behind their their homeboy, you could call him Kid Excellence. Or he's kind of our modern day Mikey Whipwreck, a guy who just takes a lick and keeps on ticking. Right when he could get under enough energy to start to fight back with the help from the fans, the villain snuffs him out. The two count once again, and now he's got him up in the full mount, raining down punches. No remorse from Dylan Black. I, I doubt. I don't think Dylan Black is. Though there's even though there's definition of remorse. I think that is a word that's not in his vocabulary. Just slapping Dylan James across the face. David James is firing back with a huge crazy. Driving the wind out, right out of the sails of Dylan Black. Is this enough of a piece of momentum for him to get rolling? Big splash in the corner. He's looking for a second. He connects. Brings him out. Reverse Russian leg sweep. Not going for the cover. But I, think, it, I think that's a mistake. I honestly, when you have somebody like Dylan Black down, you need to capitalize. But can he hit the big splash? He does! Wow. Two and 15 sixteenths from the stuntman in short and air. I don't know how Dylan Black kicked out of that after a series of moves. It, it's a miracle. Pleading, begging with the official. Why wasn't it three? Kick to the midsection. Dylan Black. Fisherman Buster. Is that all? Yes, it is. Here is your winner, Dylan Black. Ladies and gentlemen, Dylan Black picking up the win. Danger Jameson once again coming up with the short end of the stick. Once again, Dylan, Danger Jameson putting it all on the line. But Dylan Black once again victorious here at Excellent Professional Wrestling. It, it actually is start the ball of momentum for the tag team run from Norway. But give it up once again for our stuntman, Danger Jameson.